Hello, everybody. So I was having a hard time earlier this morning because I was programming Odin and I needed to debug stuff and there were no screens left. Um, I used up all the screen space in that carrier I had created. So what I built, I spent the morning creating the uh, Aesir Research Vessel, which is a small ship. It has two ports for two drones, and it has two laser antennas for two drones. Obviously, since it's a small ship, the laser antenna range is a little bit short, but that's fine. We're researching AI, not long-range communication. If we go inside, it's very basic. So you've got a locker, a TV, beds on this side, bathroom on this side. And a real slapdash paint job. This ship follows my my normal design philosophy for small ships, and that is that you should be able to access all of the engines and reactors from inside. So there are the reactors, and the green parts, the dark green parts, are all engines. Not this part, though. That's just roof. If you go into the command area, you'll see I put in a couple more televisions. And this is why I made it a small ship. In a large ship, every TV is two meters high. Every button is... The massive, massive array. So, with a small ship, I can get away with crowding in a lot of tiny TVs and tiny buttons. I'm not quite done yet. I think I need a couple more buttons, but uh, you can see I'm not planning on running out of TV space anytime soon. I think I tore out a couple of TVs. <gasps> How sad. That's fine. I'll put them back in later if I need them. So there are the AI cores and the timers. There's also a whole bunch of sound blocks hidden out in the wings. And uh, it was fun to build. And hopefully it'll actually make working with Odin a little bit easier. It turns out I think I need two screens per drone, uh, as well as a screen per command and either a screen or a light per command additionally past that. So. Uh, this is a very until I get him until I get him fixed up and understand what's going on. It's a very screen-heavy operation, and I fully expect that this will uh, have a lot of text all over it. It's already got Freya in here, as well as Ratatask, but no, they're not really doing anything at the moment. You can see that it runs the ragged edge of uh, of functionality, which is fine. It's a research ship. Don't shoot at it. If you shoot at a research ship, I'll be very upset. Uh, I probably won't make this available on the Steam Workshop. Maybe I will if I get some drones that work really well with it. But I figured I'd just show you, you know, what I'd been doing this morning instead of programming Odin. Uh, creating ships is still a lot of fun and very relaxing.